Let's get ready to rumble. So, what now? What now, he said. <laughs> the title match. You go up against Razor Hughes. Heard of him, haven't you? No. You got a shaving cream sponsor? Very fucking funny. He's a three-time heavyweight champion. Never thought I'd see him here, because, you know, he's a star athlete with elite corpo sponsor. But then his agent tells us it's a good PR move for him. Razor returning to his roots and all that. Prove he's still a kid from the street. Rocky Five? Do I even have a shot? <laughs> a good question. You could be very good. But this guy, he's a machine. Carbon fiber, titanium bones, hydraulic joints. All optimized by Night City's best bioengineer. I don't know. Maybe Victor will have some tips or tricks. But listen, I'll be honest. Don't look too good for you. But maybe that's better, you know? If Razor's winning anyway, maybe you're looking to earn a little something on it. Oh, you want me to take a dive. I'll pass. Hey, hey. You don't even know what it is yet. Yeah, I can guess. So again, I'll pass. I fight to win. Period. Okay, Jesus, be that way. I'm disappointed in Coach Fred. Alright, so are you two ready to fight? Only one round. What? One round! All it's gonna take for you to kiss my feet and beg for mercy. Right. Night two hands. Let's do this. I'm ready. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, night citizens, it's time for our heavyweight boat. Facing each other tonight, we have Razor Hughes and Free Left Heron on to your corner. Oh, is Vic my corner man? Outstanding. V, hey, how are your spurs before the fight? Good. But my knuckles are itchy. Ah. You won't get far in this sport without confidence. But you know, positive thinking's only gonna get you so far against an opponent like Razor. How do you mean? guys in tank seriously nanofiber real skin shock absorbers you can knock him on the head with a meat mallet he wouldn't even flinch appreciate the pep talk hold on now i'm not done he's got a weakness had some abdominal muscle swapped out a week ago and they haven't taken to him fully just yet <laughs> you hit him there it's gonna hurt a lot thanks Vic. i'll keep it in mind Time to say. Oh, I can't save. Well, boop. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's get it. Let's start this thing. Hit him in the gut! 
Woo! Oh man, they're Ooh. Oh really, Mochi? A loss. That's what I'm telling. Sick work, V. What you mean? I had a good coach, Michael. Fifty K. It was weird. I couldn't really target on his uh, abdomen, but when we did hit him. Whoo. Beat Rhino. Ah, now that is boxing. Good stuff. Okay, you you definitely have some emotions that you need to deal with. So, child. What are you controlling over here? Oh. Time to wake up dot web. No, oh, killing in the name. It's a great song. Investigate the site from the Bart Moss Collective message. Hmm. All right. And none of y'all want to try and kill me, so that's good. Lord knows a ton of you tried. Of course, we probably caused a massive power vacuum, so everyone's fighting for control. Okay, Bart Moss Collective, huh? That's gonna send us... Oh, okay. Right back to our old apartment. That's interesting. We've seen these random texts, so... Hey, Quiet! Am I planning on do the Liberty... the Phantom Liberty DLC? Yo, oh, yeah! Absolutely. As soon as that procs. What? Hmm? 
All right. So Rogue knew about Alt. What about Alt? Did she know about Rogue? Want to talk about that? You got to start thinking larger scale, much larger. Alt and Rogue, tip of the iceberg. <laughs> Probably, uh, not how you pictured your grand reunion with Alt. I knew she'd change, transform. All started when she went silicon, hit the net. You've changed too, you're someone else. I've had fuck all to do with it. Alt's out there, fractaling, globulating, becoming a bigger and better AI. And I'm here shriveling, spending time with you. Ah, you're bitter. Thought we'd talk, truly, madly, deeply, like we used to way back when. To fix what you busted, or to prove something to her? More like prove myself wrong. Dead wrong when I told her we had nothing, were nothing, and shared nothing but sex. That was long ago. You're talking decades. Not to me. Don't forget, I've spent the last 50 years stuck in my head. So Rogue knew about all... Did she know about Rogue? Wanna talk? Have a nice night, V. I like that Johnny's hanging out here. It's kind of cool. What? Huh. Hella nice. I know you feel down when I'm not around. Don't deny it, so I left you a little something to cheer you up. I did tell you I love pierogies, right? In any case, you'll love these too. This gluten is a godsend. All my affection, P. She's a keeper. Okay, Bart Moss Collective. Call Bess Isis. Okay. Um, actually, let's go, um, let's go ahead and have some food, man. Why have swords when you can have dumplings? Heartily recommended. Yum. Then wash it down with a stout. Delicious. Hey, you've reached Nance. I can't come to the hollow right now. If I feel like it, I'll call you back. Bye. Complete other jobs until Bess Isis, aka Nancy, is available to call. Okie doke. You know what? We've eaten, we've drank. Let's sleep. So help me if Johnny wakes up next to us. Um. Let's sleep. Till 8 a.m. 
which is usually when I realize I really have to start getting ready for work. <laughs> cool. Now what? Wait a day for Claire to contact us. Has it been a day? Because now we all we have are some some big jobs available to us. Got Hanako, go to the afterlife. I guess we go to the afterlife since we're fairly close by. But that would be giving Johnny control, and I feel that we need to go talk to Hanako first and see what that's all about. Oh, actually, we need to go talk to Vic. Might as well get a tarot reading from Misty while we're at it, but I've, if I've got those additional uh, slots for cyberware, we need to go ahead and uh, see what we can find. We'll do this part first. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Oh, look at that. Okay, for the skeleton, we have got bionic joints and a kinetic frame. Now let's go with... Body attuned, reflexes attuned. That's melee damage and melee stamina. Receiving damage restores ram. Universal Booster. Health items all also now give you armor and all stamina cost for 5 seconds. Titanium Bones. 62% carrying capacity. Mitigation Strength. That's tech. What does that do? 12% armor. I don't know. Kinetic frame we've already got, and the scarab. 110 armor, but minus 20% movement speed. Um, I like the 12% armor. That's not a bad bad thing to add. Um, let's do that. And upgrade. Melee damage resistance. Melee damage res Okay, yes. All the armors. Cool. And we can do something else to our hands. What do we want to do? Bonus stealth damage, melee damage resistance. The Tiger Claw's dermal imprint. That'd be kind of funny. Shock absorber. Um, what? Headshot and weak spot damage per attribute point? I uh, think... Wait. Oh, minus 22% recoil is the primary thing. And then... Micro generator. That's intelligence attuned. Okay. Let's do that. More recoil is always good. And it's already at tier 5 plus. So check it out, guys. We are fully augmented. That's cool. Now. Misty... You want to read my tarot? Sure thing. Focus on the recent past and what you expect in the future. Lots happened since the last tarot. The Hermit. In solitude, he discovers the truth about himself and the world. 
From this, he draws strength. His lantern cutting through the darkness. Could be you, or someone who shows you kindness. But watch out. A reversed Hierophant lurks in the darkness. He brings crisis, both in life and authority, rebellion and fanaticism. He is a grave threat. A devil reversed. You will find yourself under the influence of powerful people with unclear motives. Be very careful. The tower. You and everyone around you will experience a great shock. When the tower falls, nothing will be the same again. The tower falls nothing at all. on Judgment Day. Thanks for the heads up, Misty. I'll watch out. I'm glad you understand. Sorry, there's this amazing song called, um... Touched by the Crimson King. That done by angels and demons, which uh, were members of uh, Blind Guardian and Iced Earth. And they have an amazing. The, the song is based off the Dark Tower series by Stephen King. So whenever I hear the, the words Tower Falls, it just reminds me of that song. Alright, cool. Um, guess we should. Whoa, 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 what was that? Oh, complete other jobs until best. I'm sorry, that gave me the thing of, oh, this is a last... Last gasp. We still have an entire DLC to get through. I'm pretty sure I I'm pretty sure I've got the Phantom Liberty DLC. Should I go check? Hold on, let me check and see. I'm weird. So I was just informed that this mission for Hanako, Nocturne, is actually a point of no return. That's like the last storyline mission. So that's interesting i guess we have to do the rest of this and the only thing that we can do right now is go to the afterlife so we don't have that street race yet so never mind we will leave hanako alone at the moment i appreciate that quiet i would assume that it would warn you before you went in that it was a point of no return, but... How are we on everything? You can walk up to the door and it does warn you. Ah, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Well... Guess we're jumping into the Johnny's shoes one more time. Welcome back. Thanks, Ever. So, you ready? Rogue should be here any minute. Okay, one more time. You're just gonna talk to Rogue about Smasher, right? Then you'll hand me the wheel and hop back in the passenger seat. That is the plan. Don't worry. I'll be gentle. You might even enjoy it. Actually, regretting this already. Okay. I'm ready. About fucking time. Look a little different. Fuss with your hair or... Hey, Claire. Fuck, it's good to be back. 
Never knew you'd gone off somewhere. What's your poison? Tequila old fashioned. Top it up with beer. And sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. Been a while since anyone ordered that. I did know what that drink was. I haven't tried it. I wanted to. Thank you, Claire. Don't get too drunk, though. Never mind. Rider. They mean anything to you. Mm-hmm. Tattoo guy. How do you know the name? We go back. Where'll I find him? Got a salon in Watson, Persian Street. So what'll it be? Billy Goat or the other one? Oh god. Guys, Billy Goat or the other. Choice, I feel you. <laughs> Billy Goat or the other? Well, I need to know. Got serious problems here. Big decisions need to be made. The other thing could be anything. It could even be a Billy Goat. <laughs> uh, the other? Okay. Other one. He's gonna love it. <laughs> sure he will. Jeremiah Grayson. I heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Hey, who are you again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins, sloppy second for Grayson, after I banged her. He's gonna go get laid, isn't he? Hey! What the? Hey, drink slinger. It's gonna be like Prodigy's Smack My Bitch Up video. Yes, he does at this point. Left or right? Blue pill or red pill? Uh, uh. Oh, never mind. I took the wrong one. I think I got something better. Hey, you Ruby. What? You've heard about me? Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Just got a little biz to take care of first. Pan Am's gonna murder us. Me? 
Let's go back to my place. <laughs> he did get fresh princed. <laughs> This is Silverhand Shore Leave. Where to? Martin Street. But take the long way. Deploy the Lennons. Look good on you. Got a light? Eyes on the road. Eyes on the road! Oh my god! Ah! Lenins are deployed. Ah, Ruby! I said eyes on the road. We open Pandora's box. V. Spit blood first thing every morning. Talk about something else, please. Sure, sure. First time you walked up, since there was something familiar about you. Blah, blah, Johnny told you. Uh, you know. No. Gonk was too drunk. He called me early morning. Of course, I thought it was you. And I thought, cute kid. Too bad he's gone completely whacked. You came to see for yourself, huh? Morbid curiosity? Mm-hmm. And I found Johnny Silverhand. Feels, uh, weird. This. You knowing about Johnny. Face is changing, you know. Still look like V, but that mean smirk, I'd know it anywhere. How he talks, moves, how he smokes. I don't smoke. I know. Could never confuse you two. So sleep soundly. By the way, you now need a cybernetic lung. He made up for Locke's time. Smasher. He tell you about him? Yes. Didn't know he'd come back to NC. Johnny found some way to get at him. Wait. Grayson. Jeremiah Grayson. Works for Smasher. Johnny got a tip off some stripper, don't ask me how. Ebonike. Just that. Still, let me see what I can do. We're gonna get that son of a bitch. You know what Smash has been up to all this time? Disappeared after the Sokka Tower assault in 2023. All thought he was gone for good. Then suddenly reappeared. Did a few Mondo jobs for Arasaka, then went right back to ground. Nobody's seen him in years. Except Grayson, apparently. Can I help at all? In your state? <laughs> You're useless. Almost. Hollow buzz you when I learn something. Okay. Unbelievable that bastard's somewhere in your head. Oh wow, a slight smile. Hi, animal. 
<laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> would lay you out like this. Uh, maybe it wouldn't be bad if you hadn't chased him down with fuck knows what. Wait, do we have water in the inventory? I've, I, I've been in this before. Mint pie. Jo okay, hooch. Tequila. Uh, coffee. Okay, that helps. Wait. <laughs> Thank you, chat. to be the one puking right now. Yeah, well, life ain't fair. Yeah, you sure picked the right moment to bolt out of my body. Ought to be happy I left it all. <sighs> so, you ready? Oh, I am. Look at me. Spewing joy and rainbows. Like a fucking ray of sunshine. Well, we moving? He did keep his word. Albeit with a few conditions. Wait! There's crime! Wait, where did it say? Where are we, anyway? Apartment. is this place place where you can puke all over the carpet no problem hmm. beggar not chooser don't i yeah i have a i have a, a nice room here i thought i do it's just in a different part of the complex thank you for making sure i didn't puke on my own floor there Yeah, now we're just waiting. Hopefully that coffee did some good. Hey, hold on a second. Cool. Water. Water. Of course not. Why would there be? So, feeling better? No. Maybe... It's gonna be time. Maybe we need to go ahead and sleep this off. You know what? After something like this... Hi there, V. How's it going? Depends on what the it is. And what you want to hear. Oh, you know. Yush. I longed for you, V. Oh? I see you've already played out this conversation all on your own. Force of habit. Pan Am. <laughs> I did, though. I missed you. Oh, this is the kind of stuff that, uh... She'd, when she would come over. Take care. Talk soon, B. I'm looking for water, man. 
checking all the vending machines. Did I check out the room? No, we need to we do need to go ahead and check out the room. Ooh. Oh, it's bright. Do y'all like the new 10k <laughs> incentive? Wait, is this, uh... Did the door close on us? Well, that's ours, right there. Paste. Yeah, nothing. Nothing really to speak of. You're about to melt my brain. Oh. Whew. Good lord. Actually, let's go ahead and open the wardrobe. And where's the scouter at? Yeah, I'm going to keep that scouter. Because that just looks cool. No mail. Yeah, it's definitely going to be time to... Oh, I did find out. Okay. I guess I gotta keep using this thing to unlock that mission. Alright, sleepy time it is. Oh yeah, that's a good call. Shower before bed. Let's cancel. Can we cancel this out? Yeah. You lay down, you're hungover, and then you're like, Ah, oh, God, no, I'm not going to sleep in my own filth. We are not looking in the mirror, either. Okay. Now we sleep. Now let's see what happens if we get a full... Let's see how long we can sleep. Let's do 11... 11 hours, or 10 hours. That should get some quests procced and ready to go. Like, Claire at least should be contacting us. Need Hanako. Claire! Come on, Claire. Good lord. Alright. What to do? What to do? 
We're a victim of our own success right now, guys. Let's go here randomly. Try going back to the front of the church and skip time. Because the Phantom Liberty should have procced. Here's the chapel. If it's not proccing, guys, we're gonna take time because I'm gonna look up a. Um, I'm gonna. I've seen this uh, Easter egg, and if I can't, if we can't get the any like quest or anything to proc yet, we're gonna go find that Easter egg. And it's not gonna let me skip time. Okay. That's fine. So let's do this. Take out some of the Okay, so it's in Vista del Rey. It's been a while since we've been in that area. So... Looks like it's near here. Like I said, we'll give we'll give something time to proc. Hopefully, I didn't bug it out or anything. A bug in a CD Projekt Red game? No. Maybe there. Ah, uh, yeah, it's possible. So we've got to go this way and find the high ground. What's going on here? Okay. This is this isn't what we were going for. But I just heard the gunfire and figured I'd come say hello. And we actually have zero use for components now that were fully chromed up and This area is like heavily Blade Runner.
<laughs> that lady had sass. Um, where am I? Oh, crime! Actually, I think we need to head up here anyway. Hey, Kodo. Yeah, the honk, the honk was a bit much. Okay, we got the crime. Now, I think... Is it up here? So I just instinctively jumped over that. Ow! How dare you all! Yeah, so apparently what I need to do is somewhere up here. So apparently I need to make my way into this building. something Is there an elevator? Hmm So there's a very specific um, Easter egg that I really want to see. And is it... I'm not sure... I'm not sure where exactly... Oh, we have to keep going. Alright. I think y'all will like this, if you haven't seen it before. And if you guys know what I'm talking about, don't, uh, don't spoil it.
Yeah, here we go. So we've got the um the hotel here. And once you see this hotel sign. It's a shame she won't live. We go all the way up to the 42nd Terrace. And this entire genre really kicked off because of one particular film. I've seen things you people wouldn't believe. An amazing, amazing Blade Runner reference. Like, I'm hearing... I'm hearing the freaking um, Vangelis or whatever. Is, I'm hearing that music in my head right now. If you guys have never watched the original Blade Runner, check it out. Some people think it's rather slow, but I think it's a great film. And then you had um, Blade Runner 2049, which was in a lot of people's minds even better. It's great. Rest in peace, Roy. Time to die. And also, rest in peace, um, Rutger Hauer, who brought that character to life, and many, many others. And a big proponent of cyberpunk. He's in, he was actually in several cyberpunk video games. He did, um... He did I Have No Mouth and I Must Scream. And then he also did one that we played here on the channel. I can't remember what it was off the end of... Out, off the top of my head. But it was a horror-based game where he was playing like an old, uh, an old detective who went into people's dreams or subconscious. You watch the original cinematic ending just to see how bad it is? Yeah. That's pretty cool, man. So now all we're doing right now, guys, is playing the waiting game, seeing if Rogue will call and uh, the Phantom Liberty content to drop. We know to avoid Nocturne, because that'll be the end of the line, we found out. But we still have plenty of game to play, we just gotta wait for it to actually, you know, come to us. So he may actually take a, a nice long nap or something and see what happens. <laughs> 